I just um, brushed my teeth with whiskey because I'm out of water. Now that's the real man's Listerine. Anyways, this is day 43. It's my life 365. I'm travel writer photographer Brendan Vanson, and this is my daily adventure. Welcome to It's My Life 365. So I'm all packed up and, and primed for another day of travel. I'm going to have to catch a moto to Kamakui, which is a small village, small town. There's lodging there if I have to stay there, but they said that it might be possible I catch the last vehicle into McKenney. So we'll see. I'll probably end up in McKenney tonight. Bye, guys! So after two hours or so on that bike, again, that trip was awesome. I don't know why the moto taxis on those dirt roads are really cool. But I got to Kamakui, and there's no transport onward to McKenney. They said tomorrow at 6 I might be able to get to McKenney. And then, if I can do that, I'll probably be able to hop a ride on to Freetown. So I might get all the way to Freetown tomorrow. Anyways, I'm in a guest house here. One of only two guest houses in the entire town. Small, small town, rural Sierra Leone. This comes to about $10 a night. And yeah, pretty basic, but it gets the job done. So I might explore town a little bit later, but probably just gonna take it easy after a couple long days. So I really just ended up doing <laughs> absolutely nothing today. I walked around a little bit and I, uh, you know, waved to the kids. Hello. Hello. How are you? Hey. All right? <laughs> Hello, how are you? You all right? You all right? <laughs> you play football? Yes. You kick it. Are you good? The best. <laughs> I'm finding that rural, uh, rural Africa definitely agrees with me more than the big cities. In the big cities, you get hassled by money changers and people selling things and beggars. In the small town, the worst thing you're going to get is a little kid coming up to you and, and asking for a dollar. And then <laughs> you joke back, why don't you give me a dollar? And then they laugh and say hello and try to shake your hand and then run away. So it's definitely a lot more chilled out and, and really nice. The people so far in Sierra Leone have really warm hearts from, from what I've, I've gathered so far. But yeah, I really took it easy today. I think when you travel as hard as I tend to, and especially as I have this past week, you kind of need days that you just do nothing, maybe watch some movies or something like that. We only had two hours of electricity today, which I had to pay for out of my own pocket to, to get the generator going. So I really only had two hours worth of, of computer time. So I did some work which for me is relaxing. <laughs> and um, yeah, that's about it. I'm going to chill out again tonight. They said the power comes on at 7 o'clock to 9 o'clock, so two more hours worth of work. Then I'm going to crash so I can be up early tomorrow and try to get to McKenney and then perhaps even all the way to Freetown. Hopefully I can get out of town tomorrow, but uh, you never really know out here in, in really rural Sierra Leone. So anyways, it's been a good day. It's been a chill day. This has been day 43 of It's My Life 365, and I'll see you tomorrow.